Hello, dear student. Uh, today, our topic is on our culture, uh, where you will learn about uh, these uh, defined culture, then explore some diversity of cultures of different provinces of Pakistan. Then we'll find uh, similarities uh, in Pakistan culture. Then I uh, will uh, look on uh, the reason uh, of changing of uh, culture. So where uh, we we'll start over here, culture. Culture is actually uh, defined the ways a group of people live, like lives, like language, speak, jokes, celebration, flock art, food, then religion, medical care, language, these cloth and dressing, manners, these are all of that culture, including culture, which, which identify the person's languages and these these are called a culture where we find different cultures in all over in uh, the world so what is actual culture is a value belief behavior and material objects that together from a people's way of life these this is called culture so we find over here in pakistan different food which we find over here in pakistan uh, mostly uh, these foods are on uh, are in Pakistan, which we find over here. Some of the main which we find over here, makai roti is also of Pakistan's uh, most um, uh, grand. Our grandparents mostly like in Pakistan are makai roti. Then we find sag. This we find over here. Then we find lassi. Also of Pakistan, most influential culture we find over here. Then we find uh, sugarcane juice. These are of uh, the Pakistan influencer of our uh, cultures. Then we find korma, zarda, and palau. These are of the influence in which we find every part of the world, uh, every part of Pakistan's uh, these culture and these food we find over here. What are the uh, festivals which we find mostly there are a numbers of festivals but mostly dominance are of uh, different uh, areas have different cultures but mostly in Pakistan celebrating are uh, the influencing of Eid al-Fitr and Eid al-Azha where the uh, people are going to um, shopping and they find these are of Eid al-Azha uh, Eid uh, al-Adha was of, uh, of, of three day celebration when Muslims from all over the world offer a sacrifice for uh, the ships, cow, goat following the traditional Islamic customs. It is also called the festival of sacrifice as well. Then we find Eid al-Fitr. Eid al-Fitr is a religious festival celebrating at the end of fasting month, Ramadan. On 1st of Shawwal, Eid al-Fitr in Pakistan. Then we f uh, we are also known as Choti Eid, yeah, Meaty Eid. So these sweet Eid, these are called of two uh, main uh, most festivals all over in Pakistan. We celebrate this. Then we find of different provinces have their own identities of uh, dressing food. So we, if you look over here in. Uh, Pakistan's Punjab, the dress are various colors and design. You can look over here. Then uses uh, main wear uh, dhoti, shalwar kameez, kurta, and kosa. Some wear of uh, turban. These were of the Punjab culture dress. These are of Punjab's uh, cuisine of food uh, that mostly dominance over here. These are uh, mostly uh, like in, uh, you can look over here, biryani, korma, makai, uh, makai ki roti, uh, sarson, the sag. These are all famous of uh, Punjab's food. So these were the main dress of Punjab cultural dress. This is of uh, uh, Sindh, uh, Sindh uh, province of Sindh culture. Then main mostly. Uh, use wear for shalwar kameez and along with sindhi topi and ajrak you can look over here this is for the women's and this is for the men's dress so these are of the dresses of sindh culture 
which you use this one this is called a ajrak then we find the famous foods are of here sindhi biryani palau and palak and peli so these are of the food of uh, sindh then we find in balochistan the men mostly wear shalwar kameez consist of very uh, baggy shalwar kameez and uh, shalwar which use large length of cloth so you can look over the dress and the uh, chappal over here sandal which we, they are using in there these are the of the uh, punjab's women's uh, balochistan's women's dress which you find over here and mostly these are for the female then food of uh, balochistan was of uh, these foods and then uh, these are the source of music instrument which they are using then we come to uh, khyber pakhtunkhwa mostly in khyber pakhtunkhwa male were uh, uh, wearing these kinds of dresses with him then uh, mostly that uh, uh, women of pakhtun uh, culture uh, of khyber pakhtunkhwa dress of women was like this one then what is about the gilgit baltistan gilgit baltistan mostly all men were uh, wearing these kinds of old uh, hat and then they wear the local hat and they while they are doing even dance on there with their those these are the uh, musical instrument then this is of the dress of uh, the women in gilgit baltistan and what are the similarities in pakistan's uh, culture so mostly we find a influencer of language all over in pakistan there are a number of languages but mostly they are speaking urdu then we find mostly different religions but mostly there are of 97% of muslim population then rest of others hinduism is of 2% christianity of 1.6% then sikhism is of 0.3 buddhism is of 0.12 12% so these were of the mostly dominance are of a muslim then uh, their majorities of the dresses were what do you have seen that mostly they were uh, covered of shalwar kameez and these uh, so national dresses of this one then there our children are uh, trained to respect from elders uh, respect elders and uh, to love and care for them so these were some of that um, uh similarities which we find in pakistan so thank you so much for listening me